Donna. If you're new here, welcome. Thank you so much for stopping by. Hope that you'll stick around. Um, if you like what you see, hit that like button and subscribe. To all of my OGs, thank you so much. I appreciate your love, support, kindness, and comments in the last year. It has meant so much to me. So, today, I have my planner line up for 2022. Can you believe it? We made it, guys. We made it. So, I'm going to start with this classic vertical. And in keeping with the same pretty much sort of theme I had last year, um, I was doing the whole, I like the black because I feel like it goes with everything. So I'm going I want to get this lined up right so y'all bear with me. There we go. So this is beautiful. Of course you have your the inside is sort of a plum color. You have your social media happy planner information that we all probably tear on the book and throw away. And then of course your where you put your name. Hello, the happy planner belongs to. Then we have, and I like the way they, they set this up. I went really super neutral this year, guys, just because I, I don't want to have to cover up a bunch of stuff because I really am starting to not like the white out. And of course, the sun would decide to come out the minute that I start filming. So now I have to turn my curtains the other way, and I don't even think that's going to help. So we're just gonna leave them about like so. All right, I apologize. Let me just turn on and see how bright that is. It's sort of overcast here and I just don't, I don't like having my windows all the way open just because I'm sort of, you know, I don't like people looking in here at me. <laughs> So, anyway, let's move on. Here is your 2022-2023 pages. It's up here it says set your goals. What I like about this is you can actually, if you wanted to, you could do a whole list of birth dates down through here for the whole year. Hopefully, you don't have more people than that. So, I like it for that. You could do your days off, however you wanted to do it. Now, here is how I track all of my work hours, PTO hours, overtime. This is what I use this for. Then, plus I like to track like my daughter and son-in-law's schedules as well. Then on this page, you have your January 2022. This is, says priorities and goals, important dates. So you could break that up however you wanted to. You could use this as just January notes, whatever. First page is you are made of sunshine. Then here's your completely neutral monthly page, which I am in love with. Don't have to cover up a bunch of stuff. Your sidebar for your notes. And then this says this week's list here. You could always cover that up with a sticker. Um, you could use this for a work schedule, groceries, whatever you want to use it for. So, every page is neutral. Again, you have like your note page on the back. This could be for planning for March goals or whatever. So, live life in full bloom is the February and it's more of the same. You're going to have the same monthly layout and the same vertical neutral. So, here is your March follow your heart. Here is your April, which is just plain generic roses, which are my favorite flower, pink ones specifically. This one says, this is so much to be, there is so much the, to be grateful for. So that's your May. And then here, that is a pretty flower. Every path you cross can change the direction of your life. And that is so true. So true. Fill your head with dreams and your heart with wonder. 
if this sun does not stop, it never fails. When I'm trying to film, it's always something. I had a guy next door over here. I don't know what he was trying to accomplish. Whatever it was, he didn't succeed. I think I finally got it. Um, he was pulling in and backing up, and pulling forward and backing up. And I'm like, seriously? So, there's your July. Your August is, there's beauty and simplicity. Then, and then like one tab is white and the next tab is gold. So they sort of go back and forth. This life is so lovely. See, my September tab is gold. Oh, they are all different colors. Well, we'll go back through that in a minute. October is just a green leaf. November is a white rose that says, trust your journey. And December is red foil. I am going to make a very beautiful life for myself, no matter what it takes. Well, isn't that the truth? So, and then of course you have your next page. On the back, your plum colored, plan a happy life. The back of the planner, I haven't taken this off, is just your flowers, okay? Plastic plum colored discs. And then they were all white, except April was rose gold, July was gold, and September was gold, and December was red. So that's my classic vertical. I have been planning with glitter, and need I say more? My whole desk has got glitter all over it. Now, my other happy planner is my big vertical. And I did not go with the dashboard this time, just because I felt like, you know, the front of this says plans are dreams in the making. So let's go ahead and flip the page and let me get all nice and lined up. I love the dashboard, don't get me wrong, but I started in a vertical and I'm just more comfortable. So it's just my thing. If you want to see me do dashboard, I do not care to do it. I have some dashboard layouts here. I'd be more than happy to continue with that type of teaching or planner uh, spreads for you guys. Hello, this big happy planner belongs to moi. Okay, so this is again, sort of neutral. The the colors, this doesn't bother me because these are calendar pages. Again, it says set your goals here at the top. You have your 2022 and your 2023. And again, now these are colored in very light, light pastel colors. And again, this is what I do my tracking for for PTO, my daughter and son-in-law schedules, appointments for mom, so on and so forth. So, I mean, you have a little bit of rainbow going here, but you'll see once I start flipping. So here's your January currently page, and it's a little different. I do like the fact that you have a thinner stripe down the side instead of that big wide black margin at the top. Um, your tabs are different colors, but not anything crazy. You have your colorful, uh, you have dots and then colored hearts here. And then when you flip it, you're still relatively neutral. These are an easy cover-up with just one sticker. You can put your own stuff up here. Still virtually, virtually pretty neutral. And here, when you get into the inside, again, two very easy cover-ups. Other than that, you're good to go. You have some quotes here at the bottom. Easy cover-ups with one little sticker and, and you're golden. So here's February. And then again, your currently page. Start each day with a grateful heart. That's in color. If you wanted to cover that up with a great big sticker, one of those Mambi stickers, you could do that. That's not going to bother me that much. It's when it has stuff all over the place that I don't like. Because I can just do, like I said, one little sticker and I'm back to neutral. Then let's do March is a light, light pink tab. Very neutral, I think. 
April gratitude changes everything. It sure does. That's a white tab for April. And these are the clear discs with the glitter inside of them. And I'm going to switch these discs out to a, the large metal. And I think I'm going to go with the either black or gold. And then you have your paint swishes here. Create your own sunshine. And this is, that looks like white. And then we'll go with June. This one's a little more vibrant. You have your rainbow celebrate, the simple things in life. Not a problem for me. I don't care about that coloring. And do what makes your soul happy for July with a gold tab. It's got some dots on there as well. August, happiness is an inside job. That's for sure. And September is your paint swatches again. This is a pale peachy pink. Um, October is black. And this is look on the bright side. And November is a gold tab, Chase Your Dreams. Just the one rainbow stripe, the rest black stripes with some gold dots. And then December is purple, uh, leopard print, the purple tab. And everything else is just your plain old pages. Uh, rainbow back tab, back cover, happy plans, plan a happy life, and then write it down. You've got this on the back of December. This could be your goal maker for January. Um, um, and that is my big vertical. Okay, I got one more. And this one's the one I'm probably the most um, excited for because I have been wanting to do a recipe organizer for so many years. I have an old recipe box that belonged to my grandma, my mom's mom in Tennessee. And she gave me all her recipes before she passed away the last time we visited. And I wanna make a recipe book. And I had talked in a previous video that one of the things I wanna do is when I, I wanna do, I think either weekend recipes or Wednesday recipes, you guys vote. Do you want it on Wednesday or do you want it on a week weekend day? Okay. I'm trying to figure out when I want to do it and I'm going to let you guys vote and you can tell me what you want to do. If I do these recipe pages, whatever the recipe is, I'm going to have everything prepared ahead of time to cook that up real quick for you guys so you can see exactly how to make it. Now, if you're an old school cook like me, you don't measure a lot of stuff. You throw it in the pot and you call it a day, okay? That's what I'm all about. So if you would like to see something like that, just let me know what day of the week you would rather have it on, either Wednesday or weekend, because I just thought, you know, that sort of rhymes better with recipes. So here's my recipe book, all in good taste. And I also have the recipe, uh, the sticker book that sort of goes with this. So, this favorite recipe collection belongs to, of course, that's going to be me. And these are all your neutrals. Let me show you that book. I just had it out. It is one of the most, I think, gorgeous books that Happy Planner has ever done. I mean, it is pretty. Southern Farmhouse, all in good taste. This sort of is the complimentary sticker book to this uh, recipe planner. So you'll be seeing a lot of these stickers in this book. So if you don't have that, I highly recommend picking it up. It is a absolutely gorgeous color. The inside is just stunning. So anyway, let's move on. So we have rose gold coloring in this book, okay? as far as your foiling. I love this because you have all your conversions here. And for those of you that struggle with that or maybe a new cook or just newly married and you don't know how to cook, if you pick this sticker book up or this sticker book, this planner up, 
This is really nice to have. Here's your first page. Some of the sweet, sweetest memories are made when gathered around the table. Is that not true? This is a favorites tab, okay? You're going to have favorites, main dishes, side dishes, um, soups and salads. Oh, and I've got some good recipes for soup. Healthy uh, breakfast, desserts, and miscellaneous. Okay? So those are your categories in this book. So, this is the layout. You have, of course, the name of your recipe, ingredients, directions, notes, how many it serves, how to preheat your oven, prep time, and cook time. And then you can even write your recipe right like that. So each page is a front and a back. So you can put a recipe on front or back. Now, if you didn't want to do that, you didn't want to see the imprint or something like that, you could always cover up this back page and make it just like a notes. And what I would do, if you're going to do that, is use the Avery um, sticker paper with the gray backing on it. That way you can, can't see through it. Just a little side note there. All right, main dishes. Take time to savor the simple things. This is such a pretty picture, so country. So these are gonna be the same old thing, your main dishes, the same kind of template page for those. Side dishes is good taste good. Same thing, same setup. Here's Bon Appetit. Okay, same setup. Here is your healthy, gather with grateful hearts. Then breakfast. I have a lot of really good breakfast recipes, especially for around the holidays. You, you can just throw it in the crock pot or you can uh, do a casserole, throw it in the oven. Desserts, meals, and memories made here. I like that. I love that wood in the back. And then your miscellaneous. This could be like appetizers, you know, things like that for a party. Cooking is love you can taste. Man, that looks good. I'm gonna get hungry flipping through this book. So, and I love this. This, I thought, was so, so cute. Oh, I got something on my book here. Okay. Market list. You have all your little check boxes down here. Produce, condiments, canned goods, beverages, breads, and grains, snacks, baking, spices, frozen foods, deli, meat, protein, dairy, and household. This is a notepad. This is the back of it. Here's your notes. This is the front of it. It's a market list. Is that not just genius? Like, hello. All right. And then the back is gray with food on it. So, you guys let me know what you want to see. Um, as far as like my plan for recipe, um, planning uh, recipe type video. Like I said, I want to do a recipe each week. I'm gonna share my recipes with you guys each week and I want to prepare them for you so you can actually see how I make them. Now these are not gonna be long drawn out recipes you know, the stuff that I'm going to share with you guys is something that you can pop together probably in 30 minutes or less, okay? I'm not going to do a seven-course meal uh, in a video. We don't have time for all that. So, I hope that you like my planner set up for 2022. I hope that you will jo join me the, going forward in 2022 and become a member of my planner family. Um, I love all you guys so much. I hope that your 2022 is absolutely everything that you want it to be. I hope it's filled with favor and prosperity, peace, grace, and mercy. All right, guys. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you 
this year, I'm hoping to hit a thousand subscribers. I really, really, really want to hit that thousand subscribers. Uh, spread the word, leave comments, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.